surprised to see me again this week. It may be thinking, two videos from you in one week? We can barely get two videos from you in one month. <laughs> but I just cannot contain my excitement because this Sunday something super, super excited is happening. I mean, yes, it's Father's Day and I love my father, but it just also happens to be the same day as the iHeartRadio MMVAs. Now, for those of you who don't know what that is, uh, I think it's about time you crawl out from under your rock. Just kidding. But it's actually Canada's biggest street slash music award show that happens every year and brings out the biggest celebrities. Like this year, it's hosted by The Flawless, Gigi Hadid, and there are performances by my boy Nick Jonas and my girls Fifth Harmony. There's also so many other stars who will be there like Tyler Posey, Ashley Benson, Lucy Hale, Shamar Moore. Now this is my first MMVAs. I've been the past three years as both an audience member and a photographer. But this year I'm taking it to a whole nother level and walking the red carpet. As part of the wonderful Much Creator crew, we YouTubers get to walk the red carpet with stars like James Bay and Alessia Cara. And I am just so excited. But anyways, even if you don't live in Toronto and can't come up to the show, you can always watch it online or on television. It'll be airing live at 9 p.m. Eastern or 6 p.m. Pacific, which is what brings me to this video today. Because watching award shows are always is way more fun when you do it with friends. So I highly suggest that you guys throw your own MMVA viewing party. And I've got some ideas in this video that will help make sure it's the best one ever. With snacks, treats, and decor. And of course you can use these ideas not just for like award show viewing parties, but for birthdays, graduations, bar mitzvahs, maybe not bar mitzvahs. But you get my point. You can adapt these ideas for any celebration you throw. So let's get this party started. You can't host a party without a banner. Well, you can, but where's the fun in that? First, I'm going to create the letters using Bristol board and then grab some tissue paper to create the pom-poms. This DIY is all over Pinterest and YouTube, so I wouldn't be surprised if you already know how to do this. First, I fold the tissue in half and then start cutting strips, leaving about an inch at the top. Then I unfold it once and cut it in the middle to create two pom-poms. Unfolding it again, I start to lightly roll it in the middle, untangling the tassels as I go along. Then I'm going to twist the middle, fold it in half, and twist again to create a loop that will hold it in place. Once I've done this with all the colors, I'm going to take a piece of string and loop the tassels on, securing it with hot glue and alternating with the letters. Glasses are so easy to make and a great little gift your guests can take home too if they want. All you have to do is get some chalkboard paint and paint the bottom of the glasses. First I painted one coat, then gave it an hour to dry before painting the second coat. Even if you don't drink wine, these glasses can be used as a fun way to display candy or treats. Another quick and easy way to customize your party is by spicing up your straws using alphabet stickers. You can spell out whatever you want, whether it's happy birthday, your name, age, the possibilities are really endless. For the snacks, these confetti treats not only look super cute, but they actually taste so much better. I swear, chocolate makes everything taste better. Sorry to the 1% of people who don't like chocolate. All I'm going to do is heat up some white chocolate chips in the microwave for 30 seconds, dip the washed strawberries in, and add the sprinkles. For the Oreos, it's pretty much the same process of heating up the candy melts, dipping the cookies in, and adding sprinkles.
I think candy bars are a great and super easy way to feed your guests. But to make it a bit more fun and personalized, I decided to cut out the faces of some MMVA performers slash nominees slash presenters and glue them onto these paper bowls. If you're celebrating a birthday, you could always do this with your age or even cut out baby pictures of yourself. It's something really small, but I think it really adds to the decor. Now that I've created and put together everything, it's time to set up the party. MMVA viewing party for all of you guys and just invite you over we can have a huge party but yeah that's pretty unrealistic so I hope you guys enjoyed this video be sure to subscribe if you haven't already because I'll definitely be vlogging this experience so stay tuned for a vlog coming up so I'll see you guys in my next video bye